we strap rockets to RLRO's newest offering, the Omni Terminator. Find out if this budget RC holds up to the power. That was insane! Four, three, two, one, zero. I'm just gonna put this like way over the f over here. Okay, way over there. Yeah. Let's so it up. Let's go. Uh, we stuck a rocket to the new RLRO Omni Terminator, and we're gonna see if it can go faster than stock with a damn rocket on the back of it. Crazy sh. But I'm gonna put this camera like right here to capture the wide. Yeah. All right, that looks pretty good. Oh, is this in mono? Uh, let me set on up the, um, yeah. I introduce you to a small package that packs some serious punch. RLRO's new Omni Terminator. A brushless, ready to run four wheel drive that wants to be a real 10 scale so bad. Man, yeah, this is a good spot. I, other than the crazy amounts of salt. Yep. all of it. That was it? That was all of it. All right, limp it back. Yeah. 56 kilometers an hour. That's about, yeah. That's about it. 56 kilometers an hour. Yo, for a sub 10 scale RC basher geared for dirt, 56 kilometers per hour isn't all that bad. But you came here for some rocket thrust, and that's exactly what we'll give you. Here's RLRO's long range gyro equipped multi channel remote to upgrade all your RLRO rigs. To start, voltage telemetry, much more customizable programmable features, and gobs of channels. I mean, it doesn't fit in the radio tray, but whatever. That gyro should help keep us straight and a single extra channel will provide us with a six volt out of an RC relay, one usually tasked for turning on LED light kits. Now we'll be igniting rockets. Yes. Everything needed to create your own Omni Terror rocket car is in the description. I've even published the 3D printed models on Thingiverse for you to print your own. That's probably a good spot, right? Yeah. Oh, dish. All right, all right. 56 kilometers an hour. That's about it. So I guess I should pretty much, uh, should I just like plug in the rocket? Sure, let's see what happens. Here we go. It's not gonna go right off, is it? Well, it might. She's armed. <laughs> Don't hit the button. She's armed, man. Yeah, I'm gonna go back like enough so I'm almost at full speed before I hit the rock. That button right there. That's the giddy up. Four, three, two, one, zero. Stop. Read. 
59. <laughs> How much more is that? Like, <laughs> like three kilometers? Three kilometers <laughs> more. <laughs> but as soon as the rocket hit, it went sideways, right? Yeah, true. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Next one's loaded. It in, sm in smoke. I like lost it in the oh. Yeah, that was a little squirrely, that one. Well, let's load another one in. Yo, so I have these like really big mother effers, the F size engine, check it out. So that's the F, F motor right there. So yeah, so this was what used to be uh, in there. Like this is what we've been running. It's only gotten five kilometers an hour faster. So not very much. Now we're gonna throw an F size into it. Look at that. Okay, dude, uh, okay, dude. Hit it. Sixty-five. <laughs> That one was quite a bit louder, eh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then the pop. Put a rocket on an Arolaro. The Arolaro rocket. Ooh, we totally didn't know. This thing is sweet, especially when you put a rocket on it. What do you think, Nash? Pretty good. Better than I expected. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> Better than I expected. K-pop out. You want one of these? Link is in the description. They're uh, they're a blast. Come on, RLR. You make good toys. Yeah, good little car. Good car. What have we learned? Well, it's got a lot of potential. It just needs more rockets. Subscribe already. What the fuck are you doing?